Hey folks, Technivers here. Today we're taking a quick look at a little model I made in Fusion 360 for my daughter's electrical hobby. She likes to do wiring with LEDs and things like that and play around with small electronical components. So I made her this. This is a crank for a NEMA 17 motor. And basically, let me orient it properly here. It's going to print like this. And the handle on the crank here is going to print separately from the crank itself. So it'll spin freely. This part gets slotted onto the NEMA 17 peg, and then there is a spot for a grub screw here. This is a 4.5 millimeter slot for a 4 millimeter grub screw. Fits pretty much perfectly and tightens down really, really well. So um, I'm not really interested in posting this model because I don't think there's going to be a lot of call for it. But if you guys would like a copy of it, let me know down in the comments down below uh, if anybody wants a copy and leaves me a comment, I will post this on Thingiverse. I just wasn't too sure how it was gonna be received because it's not exactly the most useful item. Now, if we come back to me here, I can show you that it does work really well. You got a little LED hooked up to the first and fourth prongs here. And because of the nature of this device and the fact that this LED has a built-in resistor, um, it actually works in both directions. So you can see the little light lighting up there. I'm trying not to shake it too much, but once I get a pretty decent clip and then the faster I go, the brighter it gets. So um, pretty cool little toy. If you have somebody like me who's interested in electrical circuits, electricity generation and things like that, this is a simple project that she can take to school and show them how electrical generation through rotational force is achieved. So pretty cool little toy. Like I said, if I get one comment down below asking for it, I'll definitely post the link, but I just kind of wanted to show off um, one of my better print and place designs because this one came out pretty perfect right off the build plate. Everything was spinning freely and I was pretty happy with it. Not to mention the size of this little grub screw. Pretty accurate print. I was very, very pleased. So thanks for stopping by, guys. We'll see you in the next one. I'm going to keep it short and sweet. Technivorous out.